This is David with Advanced Compliance, and we are going out in the field. This is David with Advanced Compliance. I'm going to walk you through a daylighting system and show you some numbers on an acceptance test to be able to fill out the NRCA LTI 03A form. Let's get started. Here we have a full daylight condition. We have 128 and a half foot candles, more or less, 128, 129. There's our windows. We'll pan up and check out our closed loop sensor right there. Our closed loop sensor is located in a perfect position to pick up both the electric lighting and the daylighting. Let's go turn the lights on and see what our full daylight electric level is going to be. Okay, we turned on the electric light. You can see that the light level is coming down. The sun is coming in the room. The photo sensor is starting to track the light levels. The lights are dimming down based upon the available daylight. And let's see where we settle out at. I might just pause this video and come back to it. It might take a while to um, settle out the lighting. Let's see where we come back. Okay, it took a while. It took a few minutes for the lights to settle down. You can see under full daylight conditions, our combined daylight, so that's electric light, is about 131. 131 foot candles. We came in earlier this morning at a no daylight condition. We thought our reference illuminance, our reference illuminance was 62. So let's crunch those numbers and see if we have our power reduction. Here are the switches for the area we tested. We have our primary side lit switch, our secondary side lit, and these two are for general lighting. That's why we were able to turn off our secondary and general light switches as we tested the primary silent zone.